congratulations on the film. I really, really enjoyed it. And I want to ask, well, Hannah, let's start with you because being a Canadian, there's no way as a little girl you didn't go to Niagara Falls. I mean, come on. You know what? I don't think I went to Niagara Falls <gasps> till I was 16. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I'm Mom and sure. Dad never took you to Niagara Falls as a kid. No, yeah. I don't. Unless, you know, it's just selective memory, but. <laughs> <laughs> You've repressed it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was a horrible trip. Yeah. Okay, but what are your, your you know, feelings about that city? I, and I also hadn't spent that much time. I mean, I, like, went for a day trips when I was, yeah, like, the multiple times that I'd been there was, like, for two, three hours at a time. Yeah. So yeah, to yeah. spend, like, <laughs> a week at a time, you really get to know a place in a totally different way. Mm, absolutely. Yeah. 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 And Tapas, what about for you? Because obviously, not being Canadian, this yes. is a whole new experience <laughs> for you. A whole new so thing. tell me the first time you went there. Like, did you go right to the falls? Like, oh, yeah. what was it like? <laughs> I went to, I checked into my hotel and then walked straight out of my hotel room, strolled down to the falls and just sort of stared at it for a while and thought, this is smaller than smaller than I thought it was going to be. And then I turned around okay. and I was like, this so, so, I mean, I wasn't underwhelmed. I'm just say it was amazing. But I thought, I don't know what I had in my head, but I think because the rest of the town is so huge, it kind of makes this amazing thing seem so small. Yeah, yeah. So you have to stand with your back to everything to be able to just be like, wow, this is great. But one of the most amazing things was, because we were there during the low season in winter. Yes. I remember going down one weekend and it was, it was snowing and that, and everything was frozen around the falls and it was so beautiful mm -hmm. and there was a rainbow over the falls and it just looked like something something else. I think we were there that weekend. Yeah, 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 it was so really kind of beautiful and it was moments like that where you remember whether it's you can kind of tune out all of the tourists and you think, yeah, this is something really special. Yeah, it really is. Mm. Uh, there's no question about it. Mm. But we see this film in a, a little, little bit of a different light of, of Niagara Falls. And I wanted to know what it was about this script, about this story that, you know, that wanted to bring you on board. So Hannah, you want to start? Yeah. I mean, yeah, definitely the location. <laughs> like the idea of like getting to know this place, which is... I mean, it's like the uh, not only the hot spot of Canada's tourist industry, but mm. also for it was the honeymoon capital of the world. Right. So yeah. <laughs> the idea that some yeah a thriller mystery comedy could be set in this place that really gets into the underbelly of this. I mean, and I had no idea the. I mean, what the. <laughs> the politics. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh. yeah. Yeah. Or just, I mean, yeah. I love, I love the idea of setting anything in a town that is very much a vacation spot on the off season. I think there's like such a particular tone to mm. a place like that. So, and the mystery, like yeah. the allure of it. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And, and how about for you? Because what, what a role. Like Abby's a really juicy role. That yeah. is for sure. There's so many layers to her. It's yeah. I found it her fascinating. I, I got really into uh, researching pathological liars. There's so much information about it, but actually, um, not a lot of definitive um, explanations for it. So, it was something that I found so fascinating because it's really misunderstood still and I think that um, I loved uh, Albert and James's script I thought it was so weird and yeah. surreal and I loved Albert's first film so I was really excited about that and yeah. then I think by that point I knew Hannah was on board so I was like where do I sign did you did you guys gel immediately? You had to be sisters, but there's you know there's a little friction there. I don't want to go into why and stuff, but but yeah, what yeah. was the chemistry like? Was it immediate with the two of you? Yeah, immediate right. obsession. Immediate yeah. obsession. Yeah. We basically yeah we actually had to dial it back because we um, realized quite quickly that our characters aren't supposed to get on so well. So mm -hmm, exactly. Um, yeah. Yeah. Hannah's uh, quite a bit like my real sister, um, oh. which helps. But Compliment. it was yeah it was um, just so lovely. You never know. Uh, you also, when you sort of really admire someone from afar, like I'd seen Hannah's work and really mm -hmm. yeah. loved it, and so I was like, oh, I hope she's really lovely, and, and yeah, I hope and she's what I hope she is. Also being incredibly intimidated. Yeah. <laughs> Why, you felt like that? Yeah. Like, that's really? Why? Why? Well, yeah, why? <laughs> yeah. Come on. Canadians and Brits are like cousins. We're all I know, so that's nice. that's probably why. <laughs> but you know that the Brits are the cooler cousins. No, More come established. on. Cooler cousins. <laughs> <laughs> more established? No. But we, yeah, we're both, we're, we kind of have equal levels of like self-deprecation and mm -hmm. constant um, daily questioning about 
um, why are we actors? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we bonded over that. Yeah. <laughs> Having spent so much time in Niagara Falls, what is it about that place that draws so many people, other than the falls, really? Like, I know people come, they look at it, and then, then they have to go into the city. Just quickly from each of you, why do you think? I think partly the anonymity that you can get there. You, you sort of, um, it's so many people, but you, you can feel very isolated and, and you can be quite alone there, I think. Mm. Um, and there's sort of, a, you, you can really, um, whatever vice you have, there's something for you there. Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you think, Anna? Yeah, I think it like presents like a, a very crazy binary between like, that sets up the human experience of like between something that's like incredibly awe-inspiring and this natural phenomenon that are the falls and then this like really strange over-the-top grotesque commercialization <laughs> of a town yeah. <laughs> with yeah so you have like those just like bumped up beside each other it's like a very jarring but kind of intoxicating mm. experience yeah it really is it's yeah. a, it's a, this was a cool film really you guys did such a great job and best of luck with it congratulations and i have to just mention that i saw downton abbey oh you did and oh my god <laughs> oh <laughs> my so god <laughs> i am so, so happy for your character <laughs> anyway that's all i have <laughs> to so say so congratulations <laughs> on seeing oh, thank, thank you so much <laughs>